All right, all right. We're going to be going back and listening to one of my favorite Suicide Boys projects. Kill Yourself Part 13, The Atlanta Saga. Now, um, while this is just a fire EP, I do love its sort of spacey, spaced out, cloud rap type of energy. Um, it's probably one of the most emotional project they've done. And uh, every it's just like, it's a good seven minutes. And uh, let's just go in. Right? And I couldn't, I just can't get enough of these tracks. So uh, yeah, let's just listen to this classic right here. Remy Boys. Like there's a Remy Boys sample on it. Yeah. But well, it sounds a lot like Cloud Rat, but they mix it with like the dark funk percussion. And I just love the way they did it. It's just so good. Yeah. Ruby's little Ruby and Grisado with a two piece riding, doing riding, losing stuff. Inside the goosey, I'm so slow. I'm so dumb. Swerking with a bum. And, and the snare right here. And the snare is right there. So far, the way they did it. Like, it's just so good. Fuck it, I'm gonna keep on saying. Fuck it, I'm gonna keep on saying nothing. So you wanna get the fuck it? Best keep on trucking. It's just flawless, like honestly. Check in with it. The first track and the last track are both my favorite, but I'm. It's just. Yeah. I mean, those slow. Those low. I mean, pitch down snares. They just do it so good. And, and the, the delivery, dude. And then it goes right into this. And and the same I don't know what that sample is right here, but it's fire. Mm. Ah Chop just to make them wet. Hey. Like dude. It's around my vest. It's a faster track, but it's still well done and still kind of, it still feels a bit slow, even though it's fast, if that makes sense. Probably like, the fuck are you talking about, Mike? I got the Pellegrino right here. Smell of death. Uh, what? Cutthroat. Dude, fire. I'd kill to figure out what these samples are. One day I will. Uh, Suicide Boys know how to sample the shit. Empty pill bottles. Truth ain't no one to know. Like, dude. And this part right here gets me. Fuck it, I'm a fuck up. But it's fucked up. Like, everybody has one of those where, like, fuck it, I'm a fuck up. And they go through with something that they shouldn't go through. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's just my dumb luck. And then you blame it on. It's just emotional complexity. You know the vibes. Fake fucking sound. Oh, 
old mineral water tastes like garbage like old when it's sit around but when it's like right out the can you know when it's just pop like the lid off it sounds good or it tastes good i'm talking about my drink not the fucking song the song's fire and that right there that's just like genius little put in and it's like oh my god like it's this of course like like that's just facts that's just how shit goes you know what i'm saying fucking fire My God, on <laughs> this just speaks to me right here. I know, in my breath, God, ah, like, dude. <sighs> Yeah, wow. Like, dude. Step into the mind of a cutthroat. Like, and the way he goes in right there. Fire. Bento suicide. You talk, you try to get over that. you I just I get I did. And that snare right there, the way they do snare rolls and shit. And the end percussion and the way it fades out, it, it's just so good. Mm -hmm. That's just amazing right there. They just know what the fuck they're doing, you know what I'm saying? Why is it uploaded on the team sesh site? I mean, account. I don't know. That's just a fan? Who knows? Shout out to Suicide with Big Fan. Uh, obviously, like, I don't know, man. That's just. It's, this one speaks to me. That's why I had to do a reaction of it. But uh, thanks for watching. Like, comment, subscribe, and uh, see you guys in the next video.